So I've got a little spray paint in top tip for you here. When spraying small parts, uh, these steps off one of the Tamaya trucks, as you can see, health and safety. Well, because like, for example, the back side of the steps, they don't really need spraying as they're getting glued on. And the glue just tends to cause the paint to run anyway. So just get a couple of small pieces of blue tack and apply them underneath. And then you can just stick that down. But as you can see, it's lifted off because when you spray and you start spraying and then you let it dry and you come to remove from the paper or whatever surface you've got it on, it ends up peeling off and you end up peeling your paint around the ear or leaving paper, etc. And it can make a mess and it can be time consuming. Some people like to spray them directly onto the sprues, but again, I find the same problem. You go to cut it off and then you have little bits and I don't I, I can be a bit of a perfectionist when it comes to stuff like that. But yeah, if you go ahead, like I say, a couple of bits of blue tack, don't need to be too much. And then pop them down so it's raised all round. Now I can spray all the edges and the tops, leave it there, next coat, etc. Right up until the lacquer coat. And then once it's hardened off, you just peel it off, remove your blue tack, and voila. Right, so I was showing you the tip on um, the steps for small parts and spray painting. I've uh, just primed them outside because I've got a lot of silver going on here with my Mercedes. That's over here. <laughs> uh, my T cab with the gunmetal chassis. Should be good. Right. I'll just put that there. As you can see I can spray under to catch all the edges and then obviously like I say when it comes to peeling it off you're not going to be left with all that crap. Uh, I am going to have to nip out and I think pick up some more silver for this next port. But there as you can see should leave a nice neat finish right so they've been lacquered the steps uh, second coated everything else so now as I was showing you with the blue tack you can just pick them off move your blue tack a little bit thin oh. it is a simple solution to a need to finish. And when the rest of my cab's ready, they'll be ready to pop on. So thanks for watching. Happy RCing.